Hello and welcome to Pink Poodle 2. I am Pink Poodle. There is Maisie the East End Poodle and West End Poodle Priscilla. And we are Pink Poodle <laughs> What's that right in a minute? We are Pink Poodle 2. And today, apart from me looking quite batty, um, we are doing the empties for March 2021. I cannot believe it's Mar it is April already. It is the 1st of April, is it today? The 1st of April? Or is it the 2nd of April? I can't remember. Is it the 1st or the 2nd? So I'm confused which day it is. I will soon tell you. I think it is the 1st of April today, so we'll have a look. It is the 1st of April at 4.40 in the evening evening early evening we've got a poodle here that might want to say hello to everybody so hello billy bum bum here's billy bum bum say thank you for watching mummy's videos and if you like mummy's video please give mummy a pause up and if you don't like them then you can give us a pause down billy are you not interested one bit billy bum bum don't want to know let's see if dora will help out us come here dodos oh dodos here you go, here's door doors. I say hello to everybody, door doors. Oh gosh, you're gonna get up. Oh, that's it. Yeah, you made the effort. So, this is door doors. As you see, like, she's looking a little bit annoyed with me because I've just pulled her, got her up. But she's not happy, are you, mate? But you haven't said hello to everybody for a long time, and everybody worries about you. So, you're okay, aren't you? You're still being door doors. But she's getting a bit slimmer, guys, like I said in the previous video. You can see she's losing quite a bit of weight. So I have to keep an eye on her. She's got Peppa Pig nappies now. The Peppa Pig outfit. So she wears this to keep her nice and warm, don't it, darling? Hey. Anyway, we're going to say goodbye so we can get on with the video and you can lay down. Billy, stop it now. He's after his um, toy. Right, so let's get on with this video. So this is an empties video, and as you know, I will tend to put food in with it that we get from Degusta Box, whether we liked it or not, or things like that. So, and in fact, actually, the first the first thing I've got is the toothpaste um, from oh, <laughs> Superdrug, and this was recommended to me by Angie from 4F Beauty. And I really do like this toothbrush, toothpaste rather. It tastes nice. It is nice to clean your teeth. It's got a good taste. And yeah, I do really enjoy it. So there's that. And I don't let Paul use it. So it lasts longer because there's only me using it. So it lasts longer. I'm going to put these things down here. And then we've got, I got a set of um, free exfoliating. Oh no, that's not right. That's not right at all. This is the right one. So I got a set of three bath and body massage sponges from um, Home Bargains because um, at the moment, I'm not sure if I've told you on my videos or not, but I am. I have got like a hole in my um, right leg and it's having to be dressed every day and you have to wash your leg with this certain stuff and make sure it's clean and yeah so i'm having to go through that quite a bit at the moment so i'm i've not been very well with it at all it's made me very unwell so um yeah so i've got the sponges especially for that and i've got one here one at auntie maureen's when i stay there and have a shower and then oh billy and then there's a spare one for later on so there's that so i use the bodybuilding clean uh, oh can i say this philip kingsley's bodybuilding conditioner i use this i took this when i was staying at auntie maureen's and when i have a shower there when i stay overnight and i use this on my hair so that was that it's okay it's okay it's a conditioner and then i use also this mug masky one because I really like to condition my hair a lot when I actually do things. But you can do this. It's a scalp treatment. It's a hair mask. And it's a miracle shampoo. So it's all singing, all dancing, guys. It's expensive as well for this. About £40 or something for this. 
extortionate but there you go it's a good product i quite like it and it does my and like it does really good for my hair so there's that um what else we've got now we're on to the box and the and that the um extra bit so i'm gonna do the extra bit first and i have the oskia and this was the when what's that say regenerate what's that say oh god Regeneracy, oh, I don't know what that says, I can't read it. Re, re, and that's, well, it's a cleanser gel, and it smells like Turkish Delight. I think this is what, hang on a second, oh, it wouldn't be a video of mine if I didn't drop it, would I? Yes, it smells like Turkish Delight. So, yeah, it's got like a really nice, um, rose smell but not overpowering just smells like Turkish light and I quite like this and it's like I've added this in a beauty box and I've used it up now and I really like it so I only get two beauty boxes a month now so I don't think it's going to be in either of them ones but um must have had it for a while but it's lovely really did enjoy that then I put in this um disinfectant that I got and I got this in a haul and I did show this haul um, real co haul and um, I've used a couple since then but I want to show you that I do use it and it's quite good and like you can put this in the bottle and water it down and it's effective and that and it makes up to five litres it makes five litres of disinfectant so yeah so I've used that and I wanted to show you that also I used um, the one that smells like clean linen as well but I haven't put that in there but yeah there's that there's lots here guys, really lots. There's the drink we got, which was really nice. I really enjoyed this apple and plum. Enjoyed that a lot from the Degusta box. Um, Paul used this foot peeling mask. I'm not sure if it's worked, he's not said actually. It works on me when I do it, but I'm not allowed to do it on my feet anymore. So yeah, this is one you can get in pan shop for 99p. It's really good, it really does peel your feet, but I don't know if it worked for him, he didn't say. There's a Morphe um, Continuous Spray in Peach. I got this last year sometime in a haul. It was half price or something, and I thought I'd try it. I really did like it, I like the smell, so, yep, so there's that gone. There's a lot of things that I've gone through. I've gone through two of these... Um, conditioners because as i say when i do my hair i really do condition them well and these like i help with the actual um hair color so it says that um, it helps keep them bright and stuff so there's two of them there's quite a few masks and things oh these are the sweeties that paul had at the degusta box so i can't eat them because they had gelatin in them and he said they were really lovely so they look lovely and smell lovely. I wish I could have eaten them. He also enjoyed the marshmallow bar. That are, um, was in there. So he enjoyed that. Um, I enjoyed this. We got this a few months back though. In the Degusta box. And I quite enjoyed that. Because I do like muesli. Um, I wanted to include this in there because I got this for the dogs in B&M's and I got two. I got this one and I got a chicken one and oh my word, they really enjoyed it. It's like freeze dry little squares and I can't get hold of them anywhere. So I'm going to have to look on the web to see where I can find to buy these because the dogs really did enjoy them. So I'm going to put that and aside and try and find them. But they've got no sugar, colorants, flavor enhances preservatives or gm gmos all meat freeze-dried goodness preserved so i'm gonna put that aside because i want to find out if i can get them anywhere else then i use my philip kingsley elasticizer i actually decanted this into a pot because i love this stuff and it really does help with my hair so i really like this i but i cannot afford to buy a great big thingy of it but yeah i really like that 
And then Paul wore the panda mask <laughs> the other day where I put this on him and the feet mask and he really enjoyed that. Took a picture of him and he told me off. I really enjoyed this avocado mask that we got in um that I got in my haul with um the Sydney Sydney Beauty um the I can't remember what it's called now. The the one where I got the um the Earth palette. Sydney Beauty something beauty or I can't remember I got these, got a couple of these and I got the um this as well, which I really enjoy because I wear this most days actually, but that's not in the hole yet, right? Yeah, so I really enjoyed this one. I can't remember. Sydney Bingy Beauty. It's over there, I'm looking at it. I can't wait for all the others to come out. Then I bought some licorice that was um, vegetarian friendly. Really enjoyed that. Like a bit of licorice. Then I also finished. The barley cup, which we got in our Gusta box a couple of months ago. Really enjoyed this as a alternative to coffee. Because sometimes you can drink too much coffee and it gives me a headache. But I really did enjoy this, actually. What else we got? We've got some more elasticizer that I decanted. We've got one of these that I got ages ago. And really did enjoy in my hair. I used to put it in my hair before I blacked it. And it did give it some really lovely conditioning. So really love that. I put in these because my niece bought these down and she left them for me. And um, when I'm feeling a bit rubbishy, um, coldy or whatever, I, these vitamin C's are really good. They're in high dosage, so I have that in some juice. I finished a fixing spray. Vanilla and Coconut Fixing Spray by Higher Evolution. I've gone through the Hex Bomb Slay Wax Melts from um, Bubba Melties and also the Unicorn Flower. I've used all them up. I, well, I'll be hopefully in a few weeks' time, I'll be getting another haul with my bubble melties because I do like to get my wax melts from them I'm a little bit um, biased when it comes to them so that's that now we've got what's left now we've got the box and I've dropped stuff in the box and I don't know what I dropped oh yeah I am such a sausage sometimes hang on So what did I drop? I dropped a hair mask. Yeah, it's a hair mask. I think I got that from my friend Helen from Healthbeth um, Reviews. So yeah, I really enjoyed that. Thank you, Helen, for that. I also enjoyed these Epsom salts that were for aching limbs which I get a lot of muscles because of lymphedema and all my spondylitis so I really do enjoy these sort of things. I bought this and really enjoyed it which was the M&M's hazelnut or, um, chocolate. It's got M&M's in as well as hazelnuts. Really nice. Well, I'd include that, I don't know why but also. Um, I got these. I used um, I think I've used two packets of these. Um, I use these in um, for my legs or makeup, or I use these for toilet when you go to the loo for brutal wipes, as my family say. I've gone through a couple of these ones as well. If you notice, they're biogradable, the same as the other ones. These ones are in the prayer room at the moment to help to take some bits of my makeup off. But I mostly use the um, I use this this stuff to set my makeup off just put water on it and take it off with that but this is like i'm doing a swatch or something so there's about two packs of these have gone through in a month and then these were absolutely gorgeous these brioche buns that were in the degusta box they had like chocolate, hard chocolate in them my son thought it was so cold 
that chocolate had gone hard because he has the box as well. And I said, no, you idiot, it's supposed to be like that. So he looked, oh, okay. And then the protein bar, that wasn't too bad either. And then these I found in the store, which was the Maryland Treats mint flavour, mint chocolate flavour, really like them. And then I've got, oh gosh. Then I found these, if you're a fan of Biscoff, they have like these Biscoff creams. They were nice as well. They were very nice. Like Biscoff, you're going to like them. They're like Oreos, but Biscoff. Then these are very nice as well. These are in our Lidl's and they're vegan and vegetarian. So that's really cool. So it's nice to be able to have them sort of sweets. Um, I used a use all this up self explanatory when I want to do my hair I fix it it's like used up I used a magic foundation from Charlotte Tilbury one day I can't remember when I did it and I wore it when I was filming so I don't know which day it was but it was really nice can't afford to buy it but it's nice in a sachet then I ate this, this was in my hug box that my grandchildren sent me to cheer me up. So that was nice, little jammy dodgers. I used some marshmallow, these are marshmallow ones from Bubba Melties again. Used all them. Used an avocado sheet mask. This is from my hug box as well. So really enjoyed that. This is the rest of my dye that I used on my hair, which is, I think it's the Flamingo, I can't remember what one I have now. It's the Flamingo one, I think. Doesn't say which one it is, but it's the pink one anyway. So there's that. There's this that is a bit icky now, so I thought best to say goodbye to it, because it's like really nasty. But that was quite good for keeping your brows in place. The same with this one, it's a bit mucky as well the pixie one same sort of thing um really did enjoy this um palmer's coconut conditioning shampoo really enjoyed that um this melt mask by clarins that's quite nice it took the makeup off nice enjoyed this um the hint of smoke and protein this is in my hug box as well, so I enjoyed that. And finally, the um, Paula's Choice Exfoliant. It's okay, um, but I don't know if something happened to the bottle and it started leaking. So that is basically my empties for the month. So I have two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I've got one as well. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, Thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Oh, what's some more? 39. No, 39. 40. 41, 42. 42. 43, 44. 45, what, 40, sorry, 46 empties. That's pretty good considering last month I didn't have as many, so 46 empties. And I know that includes some food, but I think because I get the Degusta box, I want you to see that I do enjoy the food that we get from there and the stuff. And if I can save the year um, before Paul chucks things away, I will do. But thank you for joining these empties. Hope you enjoy these empties um, videos because it's always interesting to see what people actually um, use in these empties. So 
take care everybody i hope that you're all safe and well and look after each other and always remember it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't and if you did enjoy this video please give me a pause up and if you didn't enjoy it then that's fine if you want to give me a pause down but thank you for coming along and using 20 minutes of your time up on watching me and my empties take care everybody and i'll see you very soon bye